Not yet. The show gets underway around 7 a.m. this morning, Doug. But again, for all those who celebrate, this is a must-see event every year because, again, it really is not only a sign of that spring is around the corner. Again, it all has the streaming of warmer days. Now, inside the truck, let's break down the numbers. There is a lot of stuff going down to Fort Myers. 20,400 baseballs, to be exact, along with 1,100 bats. 200 batting gloves, 200 helmets, and of course, white pristine game jerseys, the pairs of pants, t-shirts, and the socks. Now you have to have the essentials too. The socks are packing 20 cases of bubble gum and 60 cases of sunflower seeds. Now behind the wheel will be the man Al Hartz. He's a Milford native, and this is his 27th straight year driving the 53 foot truck down to Florida. It's nearly a 1500 mile journey. Now the socks, they're going to hit the road around noon today. They're going to make a pit stop before Florida in Worcester where they're going to go see the Woo Sox at Polar Park and again give fans out there again some reason to celebrate as spring training is right around the corner. Reporting live at Fenway this morning, Matt Reed, WCVB News Center 5.